brother here who said that he's, he watched one of our videos uh, the uh, brother converted to Islam and in the in the videos uh, we said that Islam is the only true religion he wants to he wants to know if there is any proof that uh, this is the only true religion and the proof of existence of Islam Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen والصلاة والسلام على أشرف المرسلين سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين. Before I answer this question, um, I wish to have someone of uh, our brother on the converted to Islam to answer this question mm -hmm. and to ask them what do you feel after you became a Muslim. Mm -hmm. And I think it's going to be a good answer for them. But we will, do, uh, we will do that <laughs> yes. and we will answer this question yes. with one of our converted brother yes. to Islam Inshallah. to explain to you how much happiness they have after become a Muslim. That's first of all. Second, if I tell you that any other religion believing there is someone of the mankind, he is going to be a God who can convince that. How come one of the mankind to be a God or the son of God and where he is now and who is controlling this universe now without him? Anyway, I want to go straight to the point. All the messenger, all the prophets of law coming with one message, one word. Some people believing that Islam is only for Arabia and for certain areas of certain people. Mm -hmm. That's not true. That's not true. Islam, its Arabic word means submission. What does mean? We all, as a mankind, we have to submit ourselves to the Lord, the one who created us. And I want to ask him a question. Who created you? The answer is, no one can say different answer the only answer around the world is the God if the God he is the one created you he's supposed to be the one you have to obey him no one else that's what we believe you have Islam means you have to submit yourself to the one who created you because he's the one no much better what's gonna benefit you, what's gonna harm you, what's gonna hurt you. That's why he sent us a messenger to guide us to the right way and to uh, prohibited us from the wrong things. Aram, Nuh, Abraham, also Jesus himself in our holy book, he asked his companions, what do you believe? They said, we believe in Allah your Lord and our Lord and we submitted ourselves to him we are a Muslim they said that to him Moses he asked his companion the same question why it's gonna be an evidence against anyone else coming after he they said we are a Muslim we believe as you believe in one God and we submitted ourselves to him uh, Yaqub, Jacob he, before he died, he asked his sons, what do you believe? They said, we believe in your God and we will follow the religion of you and your parents before. And we are Muslims. And Muhammad came with the same message. Many evidence and improve showing in yourself. Look at yourself in the mirror. Ask yourself, who created you the eye? Who gave you the, the brain? Who give you the tongue to so you can understand one another if you ask yourself who did that you will find the truth and you will find an answer for your question